Yes, sir. That would be it. So that's 25 reais. Ah, uh, that's fine. All right. It can be card, cash, any form of payment. Ah, yes. It'll be with a credit card. Here you go. Okay, ma'am. I'm sorry, ma'am. It was declined. Insufficient funds. Next, please. No, no, young man. Calm down, calm down. I'll pay you. Just, just wait a minute, okay? Sir, please. There are more people waiting. So can we hurry this up? Sir, please. Take it easy. I only asked for a minute, okay? Hi. Honey, what happened to the credit card? I tried to use it here at the market and it was declined. Yeah, I blocked the card. Why did I do that again? But honey, you don't understand. I'm at the checkout right now. I'm embarrassed. You're making me look bad. Please. No, no. Don't worry about it. How much do you need? I'll send it to you now. Honey, I need 25 rays here. Please, it has to be quick. Wait, 25? No. Look, I'll send you 15 and you figure it out, okay? Bye. Gabriel? Gabriel! No! Yes, sir. Oh, man. Have you solved the problem? Are you getting out of the line? Are you going to buy? What are you going to do? No, sir. Everything's sorted out now. But I'll... I'll take it. Just this one, okay? Well, this is ten reais. Will it be debit payment again? Go ahead, sir. You can proceed. It'll work this time. All right. And is that really all? Do you want to take anything else? No, that's all, sir. Um, quickly, please. Of course, of course. Here you go. Everything's in order. Do you want a bag? I do. I want a bag, please. The bag costs two reais. What? Dois reais, sir? Um, no, never mind. I'll be the bag myself. Thank you. She's really cheap. Hi, honey. Are you still at home? I am, aren't I? I was waiting for you. What took you so long, huh? Ah, uh, honey. I was at the market. I even called you saying I needed money. Ah, uh, yes. And look, I'm late for my meeting. Because of you. Do you know why? My coffee isn't on the table. It's not ready yet. What do you mean? I don't know why you're talking to me like this. I left the coffee ready. It's all there. You just need to put it on the table. Eduarda, no! Wait a minute. Do you really think I'm going to put my own food on the table? That's your job. Why are you saying this to me? Why are you scaring me? It's simple, Eduarda. I'm the one who supports this house. I always give you the best. I pay all the bills. You can't even put food on the table? Okay, honey. I'm sorry. I'm a bit embarrassed now. I, I won't do it anymore. It won't happen again. Good, Eduarda. Very good, because that's not what I got married for. And look, one more thing, okay? What dress are you wearing? Where were you, huh? Honey, but it's the dress you gave me. I already told you. I was at the market. I gave it to you so you could wear it with me. You're not supposed to go out in the street with that dress. Let me ask you something. Where were you walking around in it? What are you looking for? What are you talking about, honey? I'm not looking for anything. I just wanted to feel beautiful. Actually, for you. Well, consider yourself warned. I don't want you going out in those kinds of clothes on the street anymore. Excuse me, I have to work. Okay, bye. I'm sorry, honey. Have a good day at work. Ah, uh, Leticia. Hi, girlfriend. You know what happened? Um, something unexpected. I won't be able to make it, friend. Not today. <laughs> friend, I really can't today. You know what? I'm going. I'll be there in 10 minutes. Bye. Kiss. We finally managed to meet up, huh? That's right, friend. My life is very busy here. But tell me, what's new? Just a moment. I'll tell you all the news. Now here's what we're going to do. Shall we choose something to drink? Of course, friend. Let's go. Let me just look at what I want. Oh, friend. I think I'll order this drink here. It looks so good. Yes. It really does, friend. And you? What do you want? Oh, friend. I think I'll just have a glass of water. What? What do you mean? You said you wanted to come to this bar for a few drinks. Now you're only gonna drink water? Yeah. Actually, I don't really feel like having anything, friend. I'm satisfied. Look, Eduarda. Are you alright? Is something going on? Uh... Is money the problem? You can count on me? 
No, friend. Are you crazy? Of course not. Money is not the problem. No, there's no need to be embarrassed. If that's the problem, I'll pay for you. Friend, don't worry. I've already told you it's not money. Do this. Order the same drink you ordered for yourself and I'll just make a quick call. Okay, I'll order. Hi, love. Everything okay? So I came for a drink with Letitia. My friend, you know, that one. So, and I'm out of money. I just wanted one drink, just so I don't miss out. Eduarda, what do you mean? More money? But I already gave you money, Eduarda. I know, love. But I used the money you gave me at the market. I don't have any more money. You only gave me 15 rays. Well, Eduarda, I don't care. I just want to know who gave you permission to leave the house. What's that, love? I don't recognize you. I need your permission to leave the house. Eduarda, of course you do. I want you home in 10 minutes. Did you hear me? Yes. You know what? I'm going home now. Bye. Hi, friend. So I need to go, okay? No, Eduarda. You're kidding, right? We never make plans to go out or do anything. And when we do make plans, you want to leave already? Friend, I'm sorry, but something unexpected came up. I have to go home urgently. Look, Eduarda. Honestly, I haven't recognized you lately. You used to be such a cheerful and spontaneous woman. Friend, you're offending me like that. I'm still the same girl. Just because I need to go home now. Look, it's not like that, okay? After you married Gabriel, you've been very different. You seem strange. Friend, I don't like the way you're talking to me, and I think that's just your impression. But okay, we'll go out another day, okay? Kiss. Bye. Bye, Eduarda. Bye, see? Well, well. Look who decided to show up. Gabriel, I'm tired. I'm tired of this. Since when can you call me and tell me what I should or shouldn't do? And where I shouldn't go? Ever since you married me, you owe me respect and obedience? Uh-huh. Of course I should. Back in the 19th century. But no, my dear. It's 2024. 21st century. Wake up! Lower your tone and talk to me properly. You will do everything I say, because I'm your husband. You lower your tone when speaking to me. You're my husband, not my owner. I am your owner and I'm whatever I want to be. You know what? Lower your tone when speaking to me. May I know what you're doing? Go ahead, do it. Do what you wanted to do. I want to see if you're man enough for that. Eduarda, don't you doubt me. I support you. You only have this little life because I pay for it. You only have food here, you only have paid bills. Because I'm the one who pays for everything, okay? Gabriel, you pay because you want to. I'm an independent woman, and I always have been. Ever since I left home? Since you got me out of the house, actually. I'm a nutritionist, and you owe me respect, okay? <laughs> nutritionist. With that little job of yours, you can't support yourself, Eduarda. Of course I can. And I'll manage just fine without you. It's over between us. Eduarda, come back here. Come back here now, Eduarda. Come back!